Hey guys, uh, this is Icarus. Uh, I have another video for you guys, uh, this time in relation to networking. I've been getting a lot of questions on, uh, you know, where should I make my proxies? I've heard, uh, you know, rumors that like, well, if I get this server, they have like a 10 gigabit connection and uh, so on and so on. And I just wanted to kind of bring something that in my opinion is just um, overrated. There's a lot of talk about how fast your stuff is. And when you're looking at what server you're going to get and what environment you're going to have, you, you, you want to understand um, what's important. So um, I'm not going to go into too much on what latency is and what bandwidth is. If you just go to Google and you just type latency versus bandwidth, you can get plenty of information on what it means. But what, what you need to take away from this is the faster your environment is, the better. And really how you measure that is latency. It's not bandwidth. Bandwidth will tell you how much capacity you have, how many tasks that you need. But in modern day um, networking, you really don't have to worry too much about bandwidth because almost any environment is going to have plenty of bandwidth. A lot of this is just marketing. Um, all we're doing is running uh, commands to, to purchase a sneaker. We're not moving large amounts of data. So bandwidth isn't really important. Uh, so what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to actually show you how much bandwidth is being used. And uh, this is something that you can do at home or, you know, set it up on your server and run it and measure it for yourself and make your own judgment of how much bandwidth you really need. So um, first thing I'm going to start off is in this demonstration is show you what the capacity of the network is. So what I'm going to do, um, I run a one gigabit connection. So the, remember, to, there's a distinction between bits and bytes. Bits are a little bit smaller. So um, you want you want to make sure that you're talking this in the right units. So I have a gigabit connection, which is equivalent to about 125 megabytes per second, which is a, which is actually insanely fast. Um, here's an example, and uh, here's a monitor that I've set up. You can download this for free online. Just put it up. Um, and you're going to be able to watch the traffic. So right now I have nothing running. There's just some light network going on. And I'm going to hit start here. So it's first going to do some some latency. So this is what's important, right? You want to see this latency number as low as possible. So I was down to two. So here we go. Um, don't pay attention too much here. Pay attention to this graph. So remember, I said 125 is the max. You're never going to actually max out all, all the way. You're going to... Oh, my computer just kind of froze there for a second. But it, mat it maxed out at just under 120. And here comes my upload. So my upload is back to, it's about the same amount. These numbers are samples, so you'll actually see it go over a gigabit. And that's because it's sampling stuff and it's not 100% accurate. But this meter shows you, you know, a pretty good representation of how much traffic was going through. So I'm running at about 90% capacity. I'm pretty happy with that. Um, you know, essentially, you know, I can download, you know, here, here's an example. Like I can download a five megabyte file or a 35 megabyte file in just a second, like zero, that's actually not really calculated. Right? But in like no time, I mean, it's just blazingly fast. And this is what you're going to find in most environments. Um, so 125 megabytes a second is what I'm running. So if I do have a five megabyte file, it does take under a second to, to download. Um, and this is what you're gonna find if you go to Google Cloud, AWS, or any proxy. So I wanna show you a little bit of the marketing hype here. So um, I went to Cop Supply, which has got some links to sneaker bots. Um, here is Iced Out Proxies, where they are selling uh, stuff and they're advertising 10 gigabit per second. Here's another place where they're actually charging you another $50 for um, a higher bandwidth. Um, here they talk about one gigabit, one gigabit. This is actually pretty good. This is all you need. So these only talk about one, actually one, they say one gigabyte and I doubt that. I think this is probably one gigabit. This is incorrect. Uh, I'm gonna guess it's incorrect. But here you have another example of uh, where they're charging you a premium or making it look like they're charging you a premium for this higher bandwidth. In reality, you're really never going to get there. And I'm going to demonstrate that to you. I'm actually going to show you how much 
usage you can have. So that was the pa that was the the max, right? So we're gonna go to Eve AIO, and I set up some prox some some jobs here to hit uh, social status, and I'm gonna run a single job, right? So I want you to watch this blip and see how how far it goes. So we're gonna start. This is gonna try to check out submit shipping, blah blah blah. It's going waiting for capture. It's gonna burn through all my captures. I have my capture turned off. I'm letting it hang on purpose. I don't want to burn through my one clicks. All right, so I'm gonna hit stop. So. Did you notice a blip? If you look here, there's little red dots. That's how much of my bandwidth is actually being used. So let's uh, let's scale into what happened. So here we go. So we're at one megabit. Remember, I can one megabyte here. I can go to 125. I'm not touching anything. Everything is stopped. So this is just standard average traffic. Let's let's go upload. All right, I'm gonna run this again. Hit start. Going through. If you notice, you're not even seeing a difference in my traffic. You're not even noticing it. All right. So I have another bot here. Let's compare bots, and I'm gonna run uh, the same type of job here. I'm gonna run start. Doing the same deal. Doing the capture stuff. I have this misdirected so it doesn't mess up my captures on purpose. You'll see there's nothing there, right? So it's just kind of waiting. But you'll notice that there's no change, right? So what if I run 50? I'm going to run 50 jobs here. I have it at a 3,300 millisecond, but it doesn't matter. It's, it should identify this immediately. I'm going to run 50 of them at once. They're all in testing to make sure I don't buy 50 bricks. Here we go. That's a little bit of a spike. Hit one megabyte. There it goes. Should just kind of die down here because everything's going to go into waiting for capture. You saw a little bit of uh, upload as, it, as things were like it was sending. Com so this green is what it was actually sending commands. And red is what was getting commands down like from the servers. So everything's frozen, which is fine. We'll stop tasks. Stop tasks here. Now, WAP's a little bit different. Uh, it's not designed to run so many, so I'm gonna run 10 jobs here. So we're gonna kick them all off, and you're gonna, not gonna notice that anything happening. It's a little blip. Oh, this one's coming to me. I'm not gonna touch, I'm not gonna burn to these clicks. So there you go. All right. Um, so I hope this really kind of shows you some factual information on how much network you need. It's not about the bandwidth. Don't fall for this crap that you see on online. This isn't a stab at the providers. The providers are doing what, what, what they think is best. And, you know, perhaps they have some information that I don't. And I, I, I could be wrong. But when I look at this, my, my information it tells me that I don't need any insane networking. Um, all I need is about latency. So people will talk about having Google Cloud or, or stuff in Ashburn VA. Ashburn VA is in your Shopify, so naturally you're going to have lower latencies. But don't let networking be a, a place where you lose money on. Um, I hope this helps. Um, and let me know if you have any questions or anything else that you'd like to see. And uh, I appreciate it. Thank you, guys. And uh, if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and post notifications so you can see the next videos. And um, it really helps me out. All right. Thanks. Bye.